Good morning and welcome to a Sunday morning cup of coffee with OCD in my workshop. Um, not, going on, not a lot going on today. Um, surprise, surprise, it's still raining and it's still windy. Um, haven't been able to do much for the last oh, week or so. With the couple of storms that we've had, um, we've been very lucky here. We've hardly been affected at all, other than it's been wet and windy almost every day. So if you live in one of those areas that have been affected, then my heart goes out to you. There must be nothing worse than um, being flooded um, out of your home. Um, so my heart goes out to those people. But I'm really lucky here in the Thames Valley that we've been pretty well protected, really. Um, anyway, so I thought what I'd do is uh, give you a very quick update of what's, what's been going on. Um, so as I said, there's been very little work going on as far as cleaning uh, and detailing cars are concerned um, as it's been wet and windy every day. So it really, even if I wanted to, it's not the weather to do it. And I really haven't felt like as, as I wanted to either. So I um, had a bit of a rest. However, there have been things progressing. Um, one of the things that i am got lined up to do is... Uh, Last week a company called DMAX Global, um, and I'll be absolutely honest, I've never heard of them. Um, they contacted me and asked me if I would like to um, review some of their products. So, yeah, no problem at all. So, um, I've got uh, a friend of mine, um, he's got a, uh, a Focus, and he hasn't cleaned it for, um, I think the last time he said he cleaned it was um, October time, September, October time. Um, I haven't seen the car, but he, in his words, it's absolutely uh, rank. So um, I've got these products here that I'm going to try out. So I've got um, uh, D-Max uh, Active Citrus Snow Foam. And they say it's a quite a thick, clingy foam um, that will break down dirt and lift it off your paintwork. Well, that would be good because um, I'm a little bit sceptical on uh, snow foams. Um, I don't, I think they're more of a gimmick than anything. I think for me, snow foams have two, two main purposes in life. If the car is reasonably clean, you put a snow foam on it and then you put your two bucket wash straight on top and the snow foam adds to the lubrication and makes it a safer wash. That's, that's sort of one, one uh, good thing for it. The other thing is if it's a particularly dirty car and you put a citrus wash pre-wash on the car, leave it to dwell for a while and then put a snow foam on top. Um, that keeps it wet for maybe another four or five minutes, so gives the citrus wash extra dwell time. Um, but if um, if this does as it says it does, um, and that says it will break down dirt and lift it off your paintwork, then that's brilliant. Um, but I'm a little bit sceptical of snow foam, but we've got this and we give it a go. Um, that will so this will be a, a D-Max maintenance wash. So after that, I've got um, Poseidon car wash. So again, all this is D-Max stuff. So I've got a car wash. So shampoo. So I'll snow foam it, shampoo it, and then we have a um, a wipe on, wipe off nano sealant spray and protect. Uh, it doesn't say how long it's going to protect the car for but basically um, you apply it on the car you wash the car you apply it um, give it five minutes and then buff off um, so we'll give that a go see what that's like and then the other one I've got um, which you probably have to do on a on a different day um, and that's they've got a, a quick detailer high gloss quick detailer so Thanks very much from the guys for, from DMAX for sending that stuff over to me and we'll certainly give that a go and if uh, as my mate says his car is that grubby it will give it a good test so we'll do that. Um, the uh, two other things I quickly want to mention um, so the tickets are out for um, uh, wax stock this year so if you haven't got them and you've never been before it's certainly worth considering. Um, last year was my first year and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Met some lovely people, put some faces to names, everybody is so um, friendly there. All the um, uh, products are, are there for you. Quite often there's some good bargains um, and everyone's happy to sit and talk about the thing they, 
they feel passionate about. So uh, if you haven't got your tickets, um, then it's a good time to get them now. Uh, and if you've never been before, good year to, to give it a good go. So give that give that some thought. Oh, lovely. Um, and the other thing I want to very briefly talk about, over the last couple of months I've been mentioning a little project I've been working on. Um, so that project has come to fruition now. Um, so I will, um, not this not this weekend coming, but the following weekend, um, what would that make it, the 7th and 8th of March, that, that weekend, I will be um, showing you what I've been working on um, since last October. Um, and this is a little project that I'm going to introduce in, into the channel, so it will change the, uh, the channel a little bit. Um, I'll still be doing all of the stuff, still be inviting you guys into my workshop, showing you what I get up to during the day. Um, so we'll still be doing all of that, all the stuff we've been doing over the last year, but this will add um, a different type of content. Um, so that will be uh, the weekend of the um, 7th and 8th. Uh, hopefully be able to uh, unveil it at that time. Um, I'm quite excited by it. Um, you guys, when you see it, you might think, what the hell's that silly old bugger being excited about? Um, but I'm excited by it, um, and I think it will definitely add something to the channel. Um, and that's about it. Oh, I will have some um, uh, um, stuff to give away. If you see me at Waxlock, then please come up and, and say hello. Um, it'll be good to put some faces to some of my subscribers' names. So, I'll be there, um, I'm going with my son, got my tickets, so I'll be there. Um, and I have, um, I haven't got them yet, but I've ordered some um, baseball caps, OCD baseball caps. So um, the first four or five people that come up to me at Waxdock and say, um, good morning, welcome to OCD, can have a free baseball cap um, with OCD on it. So uh, it's worth going to Waxdock if for nothing else. So I'm going to finish my coffee and uh, I think I'll give the workshop a bit of a tidy up this morning and a bit of a clean and a hoover and a wipe down. Um, it's wet and windy outside, it can stay outside. So uh, from OCD, until next time, you guys take care. Bye bye.